Hello everyone. Today, we want to bring this amazing free helicopter into the Unreal and use it with the cinematic aircraft rig. This is published by Vigilante and they have many more military vehicles, so check their products. I have the folder here. Unfortunately, this is a skeletal mesh and I need static meshes for the rig. I will export the mesh and open it in 3ds Max to separate the parts. When exporting, uncheck collision and every other unnecessary toggle. Let's import. And here it is. I'll hit Shift G to hide the geometry, select all the bones, and Shift G again. Then I'll delete the selected bones and if the mesh was not ruined after deleting the bones. I'll convert it to editable poly to remove the skin modifier. Let's weld all the vertices with a low threshold. Then I'm smoothing it with a threshold angle. Converting again. And then, I'll select the rotors and separate them from the body. That'll leave me with one body and two rotors. We know from the other video that every rotating part for this rig should rotate around the x-axis. Let's rotate this rotor so it'll be straight and rotate around the x-axis. Next the top rotor. Finally, I'll center the pivot on the body and place it under the top rotor because that's where the rotation center of the helicopter is. Let's check it from the top view to see if it's on the center line. And the body should point to the forward X. Now I'm done with the parts. I'll zero out the location of all of them. Let's name them properly. I'll export them as one FBX file and name it SM for static mesh. In the Unreal, I'll create a folder for it. And import the file I just exported. First, check it's not skeletal, then combine meshes should be off. Next, transform vertex to absolute is on. And finally since we have the materials for this helicopter in the project, we search for them and assign them automatically. Let's check them. Helicopter pointing to forward X, and both rotors rotate around their X axis. I'll create a child blueprint from the main one for my helicopter. Let's open it to set it up. First, I'll set the body mesh. I could have separated the wheels but you already know how that works so we skipped it in this video. I need two rotors for this one, so I'll go to the propellers category and since I'm a neat freak, I like to have them as rotors, not propellers, and definitely not named as right, front, or left. I'll leave these propellers empty and duplicate one of them two times and name them how I like. Let's set the meshes and then move and rotate them. We're done with it. I'll bring one helicopter to the level to test it. Increasing the propeller's speed. See how the top one glitches? I'll show you why. If I select it, you can see the rotation around the x-axis constantly switched from negative to positive, because the rotation around the z-axis automatically changes. That's another issue with rotations in Unreal. 
To fix this, I'll open the blueprint, select the top rotor, and change the Y rotation to 89.9 instead of 90. It does not make any difference to the looks of it, so don't worry it's only 0.1 degrees. Now it is fixed. Let's add a path and anima to take off quickly. See you guys later.